All right, so we've got Zach in the black, Sheldon Crazy Eyes in the black and red. Zach coming out, attacking the leg and the body right away. You know, I'm kind of a fan of the, the newer guys under five fights, under 10 fights, wearing, wearing the pads. I, I feel like you, you get a chance to perfect your craft and, and learn the technique and learn how to block properly because you're not too worried about banging your legs right. up. Right, so when you're lifting injured. your yeah. leg up, you don't have that tentativeness. Yeah. You know, sometimes these guys want to fight without the pads right away, but then they never properly learn how to block. Sheldon trying to get out of the clinch and lands a yeah, right he, hand he, as he's ex you can see they're, exiting. These guys are kicking a lot more than that first group. Oh, a big uppercut lands in the middle for Zach. These guys are not holding back. No. Sheldon's kind of throwing the overhand right. Yeah, Sheldon's punches come a little bit loopy. I feel yeah. like Zach's punches are a little straighter. Getting there a little bit quicker. Right now, you know, Zach has the body lock in. Just kind of tying Sheldon up there in the corner. Sheldon's trying to spin Zach around and get a more dominant position. Tell you what, all this holding wastes a lot of energy. Oh, absolutely. I mean, you can clinch for a half hour in the gym, you feel great, you get in the fight. 30, <laughs> 30 seconds of clinching, you feel like it's, you've been doing it all night. Definitely, your arms don't be, aren't as strong. Yeah, but these guys like are still... to work a little bit on that right hand. He's kind of slapping with it a bit. Yeah. Looks like Zach's timing him up the middle of the straight right hand. Big still up. an exciting fight. Big body kick, but Sheldon just kind of comes forward with his hands. There's that overhand right again. The jab lands by Zach. Zach now in the corner. Sheldon throwing a big knee. Nice knee by Zach. Step in knee. I, I got to say, Zach's jab has been very, very good and effective. Oh, nice body kick. I think oh. if I had to. Uh, I was after the bell, but again, he was in the middle of transition. I don't think that was an intentional I think thing. If I, had I would know. I trained there. I lied. I have heard of them. <laughs> you have heard of them. Right, Sheldon again is trying to attack right away. He walks into Zach's clinch. I think he should stay in the distance a little more and keep using his hands. Yeah, because he seems to have pretty good boxing. But, you know, he does throw some good he puts, hooks he, while he's, he's on pretty, the inside. He's pretty well-rounded. He's backing Zach up here with punches. Zach goes for the clinch. I like the kid. He's relentless. He's throwing everything with power. Yeah, for sure. He's not here to play around, that's for sure. I see Sheldon look over at his corner for a second during that exchange. He might be a little bit lost out there. His feet seem to be a little bit all over the place. Uh, yeah, it, it, like he's been switching back and forth from Southwell to Orthodox, but yeah, really, you, you don't really generate. You don't generate a lot of power like that. You, yeah. you don't have a good base under you. I'm not really sure what that was warning was for. Like I think he was possibly holding the back of the head. Oh, there goes that wild right hand again. Uh, now he's like unloading a little bit with punches. Yeah, Zach's trying to get out of that corner he's and answer to the right. His right foot's coming forward as he punches and he's squaring himself up and that gives Zach a chance to land that straight right hand. Right. Now Zach backing Sheldon up here. I think Zach might have hurt him in the body with that right oh, knee. Oh, nice, smart. nice, good body punch. Beautiful. Goes up top, blocked by Sheldon, but he does penetrate a bit. I like this kid. He's patient. He's oh, picking his shots. Beautiful uppercut. After that knee to the body, he attacked it with a straight right hand. Look at that Sheldon coming back. I think Zach's knees of the body are affecting Sheldon. Yeah. Nice kick by Zach. What's happening is even though Sheldon is hitting Zach, he's kind of swatting. Yeah, he's kind of kind of just winging his arms. His feet are all over the place. I don't know if he's uh, he's not looking too good out there. Uh, try to straighten out your punches, but you can't fix something like that in a round, I think. No, that's that's work you do back in the gym. And I think you're just gonna have to go forward if you want to, you know, win it. You're down two already. Kind of have to get a knockdown or a knockout. It's, it's tough to do in the amateurs. You got the bigger gloves on. You have the shin pads. Right now, you can see that Zach was locking up Sheldon's arm by bringing his arm underneath Sheldon's shoulder, uh, elbow, so that Sheldon is unable to pull his arm out of the clinch. Yeah, them body shots are taking their toll. He was able to trap him there with his arm. You can see that good clinch technique there by Zach. Yeah, that body shots are definitely taking a toll. His feet are all over the place. Yeah, yeah he's very, very uneven. 
as you can see, and he's kind of walking forward he's instead of work. pushing or jabbing forward. You know, some guys get a little, they, they, they jump ahead with too many steps, you know. They, right. Before they learn their base, they're trying to do all this other stuff. And he's really unloading with punches. I mean, he's got he's got the will to fight. I just feel like he's got to brush up on a couple little things there. And well, I know that's a big deal for you. Oh, beautiful teep there by Zach. I, I love the basics. Daria's corner, Daria is telling Zach to continue to push forward, to keep pushing Sheldon forward so that he wins this round. I, I like that he's not, he's not wasting any punches, Zach. No. He, he's taking his time, he's looking, he's placing the shots. Absolutely, but you never know what the judges see. They see Sheldon throwing a lot of punches, and even though they're not connecting as much, ooh, the head kick. I, mean, I, I would like to believe that these judges are a little bit better than, than that. And I, I, you know, if you, if you give the wrong guy a decision in this fight, I mean, I think it's time to get new judges. <laughs> I agree. I'm, I, I've never judged a fight just for that reason. I don't want to ever be put in that Absolutely. position where I have to Big right hand give an opinion about who won. But I think I even even I could judge this fight. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> I mean, the, the kid Sheldon's giving it giving it all he's got. He's in the fight, that's for sure. But you can see his feet are a little bit a little bit sloppy here again, and he's walking forward. Yeah, they're both giving it every single thing that they got. That was a great body kick that ends the round. Yeah, that was a good fight. It was an entertaining fight. Definitely entertaining. That both of these guys have heart. Um, use the first round. All kind of right, ladies out. and gentlemen. After three rounds of action, we do have a winner by unanimous decision. Zach. Go. Yeah, you can see Sheldon even pointed to a, Zach at that time. He, it was a good decision, but it was still a heck of a fight. Sheldon definitely came to fight. That's for sure. Yeah, heart is not something that either. You know, he's, he's got.